Hello students, now we will solve more examples on area of triangle and collinearity of points. So here the example is find K so that the point P minus 4, 6 lies on the line segment joining A, P 10 and B, P minus 8. So here A and B are end points and A, coordinates of A is given k, 10 coordinates of b are given 3, minus 8 and point p divides line segment ab so coordinates of point p is given minus 4, 6 so we have to find coordinates of point a that is uh, k and also we have to find the ratio in which p divides ab so first we have to find value of k so here these three points are collinear points because all these three points lie on the line segment. So we have to use collinearity condition that is x1. First we have to write here points A, P and B are collinear points. Therefore x1 y2 minus y3 plus x2 y3 minus y1 plus x3 y1 minus y2 is equal to 0 and then now we will put values so x1 that is k y2 minus y3 that is 6 minus minus 8 plus x2 that is minus 4 y3 minus y1 that is minus 8 minus 10 plus x3 that is 3 y1 minus y2 so 10 minus 6 is equal to 0 so you have k into 6 plus 8 minus 4 into minus 8 minus 10 that is minus 18 plus 3 into 10 minus 8 that is 4 is equal to 0 so 8 plus 6 14 that is 14 k minus 4 into minus 8 that is plus 72 and 3 into 4 that is 12 is equal to 0 so 14 k plus 84 is equal to 0 14 k is equal to minus 84 so k is equal to minus 6 so here value of k is minus 6 now we will find the ratio in which p divides a b so here coordinates of point p we will we have coordinates of point a that is minus 6 10 coordinates of point p that is minus 4 6 and coordinates of point B is 3 comma minus 8. Now we have to use section formula. Suppose, so here we have to write first. Suppose P divides AB in, in the ratio M is to L. So here P divides AB in the ratio M is to L. So by using section formula, coordinates of point B that is mx2 plus nx1 upon m plus n so we can use either x coordinate or y coordinate of point B so coordinates of point B is mx2 plus nx1 upon m plus n this is equal to x coordinate of point B is given minus 4 and x1 y1 this is x1 y1 this is x2 y2 so here we have to put values m into x2 that is 3 plus n into x1 that is minus 6 divided by n plus n is equal to minus 4. So 3n minus 6n this n plus n we have to multiply here. So minus 4 into n plus n. So 3m minus 6n is equal to minus 4m minus 4m so minus 4m we have to shift 
here that is 3m plus 4m 7m and minus 6m if we shift here that is 6n minus 4m that is 2m so if you have to find m by n this n we have to shift here and this 7m we have to shift here so m upon n that is 2 upon 7 so point P divides AB in the ratio 2 by 7 Okay, next example. If the area of triangle ABC formed by A x y b 1 2 and c 2 1 is 6 square units, then prove that x plus y is equal to 15 or x plus y plus 9 is equal to 0. So here area of triangle ABC is given 6 square units. So first we have to write this area of triangle ABC is equal to 6 square units. Now we have a formula half into mod of x1 y2 minus y3 plus x2 y3 minus y1 plus x3 y1 minus y2 is equal to 0. Now we have to put this values. So coordinates of A are x1, this is x1 y1, this is x2 y2 and this is x3 y3. So we have to put these values here. So half into mod of x1 is x y2 minus y3 that is 2 minus 1 plus x2 that is 1 y3 minus y1 so 1 minus y plus x3 that is 2 y1 minus y2 so that is y minus 2 is equal to 0. So half so it is equal to 6. We have to take here 6, 6 square units. So half into mod of 2 minus 1 that is 1. So 1 into x, x plus 1 into this bracket means 1 minus y plus 2 into y minus 4 is equal to 6. So half into mod of, we have to simplify this x minus y plus 2y that is plus y and plus 1 minus 4 that is minus 3 is equal to 6. Now this 2 we have to shift here so mod of x plus y minus 3 is equal to 12. Now if x plus y minus 3 is equal to 12 if we remove this mod we have to give plus minus sign either this side or this side because we don't know value of this term if it is negative or positive so if we have to remove this mod we have to give plus minus sign either this side or this side so we have to give plus minus sign this in this side so here x plus y minus 3 is equal to plus minus 12 so if I am taking plus 12 so x plus y minus 3 is equal to 12 or x plus y minus 3 is equal to minus 6 so if we simplify this x plus y is equal to 15 or x plus y is equal to minus 6 plus 3 or here minus 6 plus 3 that is sorry here we take minus 12 so minus 12 plus 3 that is minus 9 if we shift this side so x plus y plus 9 is equal to 0 or x plus y is equal to 15 so we have to show that or we have to prove this x plus y is equal to 15 or x plus y plus 9 is equal to 0 okay Next example is if the coordinates of two points A and B are 3, 4 and 5 minus 2 respectively, find the coordinates of any point P if PA is equal to PB given and area of triangle PAB is 10 square units. So first we have to take coordinates of point P. Coordinates of P are x comma y then PA is equal to PB so these two distances are equal so by distance formula 
you will find these distances that is PA square is equal to PB square equals to root square on both sides then by using distance formula this is x minus 3 square plus y minus 4 square is equal to x minus 5 square plus y plus 2 square because there minus 2 is there so if we expand this x square minus 6x plus 9 plus y square minus 8y plus 60 is equal to x square minus 10y plus 25 plus y square plus 4y plus 4 so here this is x square x square y square y square will get cancelled so here minus 6x minus 8y plus 25 is equal to minus 10y plus 4y is equal to so here minus 10x so minus 10x plus 4y plus 29 now minus 10 is going to shift here that is 10x minus 6x that is 4x minus 8y minus 4y that is minus 12y and if we shift, shift 25 this side so 29 minus 25 so 4x minus 12y is equal to minus sorry plus 4 so if we divide it by 4 we will get x minus 3y is equal to 1 so this is equation 1 now area of triangle PAP is given 10 square area so we have to use formula of area of triangle that is area of triangle PAP is 10 square units given so half into mod of First, I am adding a formula x1 y2 minus y3 plus x2 y3 minus y1 plus x3 y1 minus y2 is equal to 0. So, half into mod of x1 we have to take this is x1 y1, this is x2 y1, and this is x3 y3. So, x1 that is x4 minus minus 2. plus x2 that is 3 into minus 2 minus y plus x3 that is 5 y1 minus y2 so y1 is y minus y2 that is 4 now half into mod of so here you have 10 square units area is given 10 so half into mod of x into 4 minus minus 2 that is 4 plus 2 that is 6 plus 3 into minus 2 minus 5 so we have to multiply this that is minus 6 minus 3y plus 5y minus 20 is equal to 10 so half into mod of 6x minus 6 minus 20 that is minus 26 minus 3y plus 5y that is plus 2y is equal to 10 so this 2 we have to shift here that is mod of 6x plus 2y minus 26 is equal to 20 so if we remove this mod sign we have to give plus minus sign so 6x plus 2y minus 26 is equal to plus minus 20 so if we take plus 20 so 6x plus 2y minus 26 is equal to 20 or 6x plus 2y minus 26 is equal to minus 20 so if we simplify this 6x plus 2y is equal to minus 26 if we shift here that is 20 plus 26 that is 46 or 6x 
plus 2y minus 20 minus 26 if, if we shift this side then that is minus 20 plus 26 that is 6 so if we simplify this 3x plus y is equal to 23 or 3x plus y is equal to 3 This is the equation you have to give number that is second equation and this is third equation. Now we have to solve first and second equation. We will get coordinates of point P and again we have to solve equation 1 and equation 3. Again we have to get coordinates of point P. So first we have to take and taking these two equations x minus 3y is equal to 1 this is first equation and second equation that is 3x plus y is equal to 23 this is second equation now we have to solve this two equation so if we multiply this equation by 3 so we will get equation is 3x minus 9y is equal to 3 and this equation we have to write 3x plus y is equal to 23. Now we have to subtract this two equation. So if we subtract this two equation, sign will be change. This is minus, minus, minus. So 3x minus 3x, this will get cancelled. Minus 9y minus y that is minus 10y and minus 23 plus 3 that is minus 20. So y is equal to 2. Now if we put y is equal to 2 in any one equation, so here I am putting this y is equal to 2 in first equation. So x minus 3 into 2 is equal to 1. So x minus 6 is equal to 1, x is equal to 7. So in first case, coordinates of point P. Sorry, B having coordinates minus 3, 
55 and C have the coordinates 4 minus 2. So half into mod of x1 that is x y2 minus y3. So y2 minus y3 that is 5 minus minus 2. So 5 minus minus 2 plus x2. So here x2 is minus 3 y3 minus y1 so minus 2 minus y1 is this plus x3 that is 4 y1 minus y2 that is y minus y2 is this 5 so half into mod of x into 5 minus minus 2 that is 5 plus 2 or here we can write directly 5 plus 2 is 7 minus 3 if we multiply this side this is minus 3 into minus 2 plus 6 minus 3 into minus 1 plus 3 y plus 4 if we multiply this side that is plus 4 y minus 20 so half into mod of 7x 3y plus 4y that is 7y and 6 minus 20 that is minus 40. So here we can take 7 common so half into 7 we can take common outside the mode so half into the 7 in mode x plus y minus 2 to the value. This is 7 by 2 and in mode x plus y minus this is area of triangle ABC. Now we have to find area of triangle ABC. So area of triangle ABC. Area of triangle ABC is equal to half into mod of ABC. We have this coordinates 6, 3, minus 3, 5 and 4 minus 2. So x1, 6, y2 minus y3. 5 minus minus 2 plus x2 minus 3 5 sorry minus 2 minus 3 plus x3 that is 4 and in bracket y1 minus 5 that is 3 minus 5 so half into mod of 5 plus 2 7 to 6 into 7 minus 2 minus 3 that is minus 5 and minus 5 into on the other side minus 3 into this minus 5 plus 4 into 3 minus 5 that is minus 2 so half into mod of 6 7 is a 42 this is 50 plus 50 and this is minus 8. So half into mod of 15 minus 8, 7. 42 plus 7 that is 14. So half into mod of 49 means 14. So area of primary ABC is 49 by 2. Now we have to find the ratio of area of triangle PBC and area of triangle ABC. So area of triangle PBC is 7 by 2 mod of x plus y minus 2. So here we have to find the ratio of area of triangle PBC and ABC. So area of triangle PBC divided by area of triangle ABC is equal to area of triangle PBC is 7 by 2 mod of x plus y minus 2 divided by area of triangle ABC is 49 by 2 so if we simplify this this 2 will get cancelled so 7 into mod of x plus y minus 2 divided by 49 so 7 7 is 49 so mod of x plus y minus 2 upon 7 now here this 7 is positive so we can write in mod x plus y minus 2 divided by 7. So ratio of area of triangle PBC and ABC is mod of x plus y minus 2 upon 7.